Hey everybody, this is Captain Kyle and I'm here with an unboxing of a mystery box. This is a Transformers mystery box that I got from Baltimore Comic Con. It doesn't sound that full. It cost me $40. We're going to open it up and see if it's worth it. Be right back. Okay, let me preface this by saying normally I don't get mystery boxes because I like to know what I'm buying. But I was bored. I figured, hey, maybe it might make a good video. Maybe it could be fun for you guys. So I bought this and I am going to open it up and see what's inside. I did not open it up prior to this. So any reactions you see will be genuine. So here we go. Oh, it's in the box. So I open it up and from this angle here, there I can see there's not a lot in here. So let me see what's in here first. So the first thing we find is a Transformers lanyard. Ooh. So when I go to a Transformers themed convention, I can hook my badge to this. Or, you know, if I go at any other type of convention. It is a lanyard. That's all I have to say. So not necessarily something I would have bought separately, but maybe you're the lanyard loving type. We have a keychain. Now this looks actually interesting. What we have is a seat belt buckle keychain. Very interesting. So you can uh, attach it to your belt, put your keys on it, but it's like a seat belt and you can take your keys off your belt when you need it. It's got two little key rings on it. It looks pretty interesting. Again, nothing I would have actually purchased for myself. Yeah, I am not sure what it's worth. I might try it out, I'm not sure. A wallet. It is a Transformers wallet and it can hold some cards. It doesn't hold as many cards as my current wallet, but it doesn't have any cash in it. That's a shame. And I'm not gonna put any in it probably, but it's a neat little wallet. Again, not necessarily something I would have bought for myself just because it doesn't have a ton of space for all the myriad membership cards and insurance cards and credit cards that I have. All right, couple more things. We have this. It is a this. It is a metal box, has a image of Transformers number one on it. I do not know if it's licensed. And if I hold it, it is for, I guess, credit cards or holding cards. It's got these side things. I guess it's kind of a, a wallet-ish or card holder or the suggestion has come mint tin but i don't know what these would be for it could be a cigarette holder there you go let's just promote unhealthy behavior i, I don't know that hasbro is uh, behind this but if they are a way to kill off your customers hasbro yeah i guess or it could be a business card holder i could put business cards in here and whip it out at a con so far, I mean, interesting stuff. Nothing I would have bought for myself. And there's a final item. It appears to be a belt. I'm kind of relieved there's no t-shirt in here. Relieved slash disappointed because a t-shirt, you know, it depends on what size the t-shirt is. But this is a Transformers belt, which you squeeze somehow. So it's a belt. Lift tab, feed through or pull out. A lot of pulling out today. Yeah, it doesn't seem to damage the material much, but it's a belt. It might fit me. I don't know that uh, a Transformers belt is something that I would normally wear. Maybe at a Transformers con. The box is cool. I can use it to hold Transformers instructions and such. I mean, the stuff is not bad stuff. It's just, again, something I probably would not have gotten separately for myself. However, I will put the link to the vendor for this stuff and you can buy these things separately and deliberately if you'd like. So that is my Transformers mystery box. The mystery has been demystified. Yeah, I guess I'll maybe use a couple of these or I don't know. You might see them on a vendor table that I buy at some con near you. So thank you for joining us on this journey into mystery and we will see you next time possibly with some toy reviews instead of this very interesting merchandise. Check out the other videos we have over here. Like, share, subscribe, all the stuff. We'll see you next time. And as always, have fun and good hunting.